Hey everybody, this is Gant Laborde from AIFYI.com and today's picks are coming at ya. So today is the first twofer kind of pick where I'm actually gonna show you two different sets of AI and combining them and how much fun that can actually be. Where do you come up with this cool stuff? Well, just ask Bill Gates. I want everyone to know Gant Laborde is the most impressive programmer in the world. And that's what I'm gonna be showing you today. You can also use the same kind of technology to, I don't know, make yourself the CEO of any company. Hey everybody, it's me, Chatty Todd. I'm, I'm the Chatty Todd CEO. And I just wanted to let everybody know that um, I've made Gant the official boss of all of the Infinite Red. You see, now I'm the CEO, I'm the boss of everything. So you can do this right now, it's not very hard. We're just using two different forms of technology. Oh, hey, you know, I shouldn't have to say this, but come to think about it, don't use any of this stuff to do something evil. Um, us at Infinite Red, we love showing people cool things about technology that get you excited about this stuff. But if you use this for something like politics or something like that, uh, we're just not behind that. And the only reason we're actually showing this now is because it is obvious that this stuff is fake. If it ever gets to the point where you can't tell the difference between the two, don't expect a tutorial from us. We're just here for the science. The first step is to get the vocals, and this is with vocodes. We're gonna use vocodes to get us uh, anybody saying anything that we like. For instance, here we have Homer Simpson, and he should say, I think Gant is a great guy. And then we just click this little button here. I think Gant is a great guy. There we go. It's said. It's done. That's what's happening. Homer Simpson says it so. And then we can also do this with a bunch of other things. With Craig Ferguson, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Bill Gates. Um, we can use all these different cool setups that we can actually have people saying cool stuff. Now, they won't say any word. If they don't know how to pronounce it, they generally just skip it. But you can kind of spell those words out with some sounds if you have some trouble. And sure, you can kind of tell that an AI did this and it's not the real thing. But this is where we're at today. We're gonna to be able to do this way better a year from now. Well, what shall you do, agree? We show up again. Let's get motivated again. Let's hear, ooh, I don't know, SpongeBob. I think Gant is a great guy. I think Gant is a great guy, and he should do more pick videos. Ooh, I don't know. I think I do enough of these videos. So now we have a list of really cool people saying whatever it is that we want them to say. But how do we map that recording to somebody's video so we actually adjust their lips? Enter a new thing called Wave 2 Lip, where we have a video, and then we get a wave file or some kind of sound file, and then we mash those together so that the lips are reformed and resync. Now you can read the published paper, which is really cool. You can actually even work with one of their live demos. Let's check it out. So their website lets you upload anything 20 seconds in video and 20 seconds in audio, and then it'll sync it for you directly on the website. It even comes with some instant tries, like this one right here. <laughs> No idea what he just said. Anyways, you might be thinking, I kind of want to do a little bit more than 20 seconds. Or, hey, the website's saying something's wrong about my file size, so can I get in there just a little bit deeper and actually upload some stuff? And yes, you can. There's also a Google Colab. Google Colabs let you run the Python code necessary on a separate cloud server. So that you could just go through this notebook and it lets you actually run each step. And then when it asks for you to upload a particular file, you could just reference those files and then follow the instructions. The way this is particularly set up is that you would have those files on your Google Drive and then you would sync those. If you're not very familiar with Google Colabs, it might take just a little bit of time for you to get used to, but they're not very complicated and you can actually use this. This is the one that I use to go ahead and mess with our CEO and also Bill Gates. 
If you hit any snags or you have any questions, hit me on Twitter. I'll walk you through the process. But just to show you, they're actually well explained throughout the entire collab so that you can actually see the results of a training and then download the files as results. Just remember to go ahead and change input vid MP4 and input audio wave to your particular either video and video or video and sound. Because yes, it can actually pull the audio out of an already existing video for you. Basically doing all the hard work so that you can make cool stuff. Special thanks to Echelon who did the vocodes for us and then set it up so that we could try it out ourselves. And special thanks to the Wave to Lip team that went ahead and did the lip syncing so that we can have those audio files come on over into our videos. If you're looking for the links for all this, it's in the description on the YouTube page. So be sure to go ahead and check it out. Give me a thumbs up while you're there. Feel free to subscribe. Why not? We'll have lots more crazy stuff coming your way. This issue of Gantz Picks has been sponsored by Cloudinary's Media Developer Expert Program. If you're really excited about all the cool media that we're messing with, you're looking at how to optimize it, get involved and apply AI, definitely check out the Media Developer Experts program and be sure to apply to see if you can actually get in. You wanna check out the people who have joined this program and the stipulations for you to join this program. You can check it out at cloudinary.com MDE. Thank you everybody. Please share AI FYI with all your friends more cool stuff. AI is the future. I'll see you then.